Hey everyone, today I wanted to give you some life hacks for your chat box. So right now it is miracle time for weapons, and uh, as you can see here, you know, this chat just is not readable for like your friends list or your guild at the moment. Uh, between all the megaphones and all the announcements for miracle time, all the system messages for gaining honor EXP, or like if you've got skill messages, like you can't use that skill yet for cooldown skills that you're mashing. Uh, there's a few things you can do to rectify this. So if we go into the settings under social, uh, the first thing I like to do is, you see I already have timestamps enabled. I like timestamps because sometimes I'm crafting and I've got my chat off to the side and I'm watching something on my main monitor. It's just nice to glance over and be like, oh, it's been five minutes since I crafted that thing. Uh, you can also change your font color and font size. So if we change it to like super big, you know, I think that's actually quite nice. Uh, I don't like having to squint to be able to read anything. This is like unreadable to me on the smallest setting, so I like to have it on setting number three, that personally. Uh, now we can also change the font color. You can change each different kind of chat to whatever color you want. Uh, I've got my uh, guild chat on purple, alliance chat on cyan, friend chat orange, whisper green. So a lot of the default ones, but I pretty much just switched guild chat and alliance chat because I'm used to that from the old, old days. Uh, so you can do that to whatever color you want. You just click on the color icon here and you have a few options of colors you can change it to. Uh, now, how do we deal with the spam problem? So uh, either in the social tab, you can check this box to separate the chat. And what that does is it creates this menu where you have megaphone chat in its own thing. And immediately we can see our chat is readable because the system messages for like honor exp and stuff are at the top battle notification has its own tab megaphones and miracle time has its own tab and now we just have our main chats in here now gachapon messages and stuff will still show up in this tab so what you can do is actually click on this plus button and if you just select all of these boxes here and you create that new chat tab you hit the edit pencil thing when you're done selecting the boxes you want. Uh, it will actually just hide like those red gachapon messages, you know, and other messages that might show up here that aren't just put up into system messages and what have you. So I always have my chat tab on just one that has all these boxes checked because it gets rid of those miscellaneous system messages. You can't delete this original all tab here, which is unfortunate but that is how it is. Now, you can also uh, pop your chat out by clicking on the bottom right button on the chat here as well, if you don't wanna go into the system menu to do that. And if you got a second monitor, you can just drag the chat right on off, which is really nice, at least in windowed mode. Uh, so if you are in full screen, you kinda can't do that just because of the way full screen works with windows, you aren't allowed to have a popped out chat. So you have to be in windowed mode. I just do windowed mode, basically the same size as my monitor, you know, 1920 by 1080. I pull the chat off to the side and then I've got a very readable chat. So hopefully this uh, alleviates some of your frustrations with being able to read your chat, especially during these miracle time events. And thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.